I wanted to chat with you a little bit about feelings and hear some of your thoughts about what's helpful in lockdown in relation to feelings. Okay, well, as most people know, there are millions of different emotions that take control when they think are necessary. That all happens inside your brain. So there are emotions like fear, anger, sadness, that usually panic or just start thinking the bad of every situation or say, well, we lost that game. Let's be really sad now because we're not as good as the people who won. And then there's happiness, like excitement. Actually, the reason we didn't win isn't because we're not good. It's just because we're not the best at that game yet. And they kind of fight a bit over what the brain should be thinking about. And you get this idea that sometimes happiness wants to be happy, but sadness wants to be sad. But I've been experiencing that sadness has taken over a lot during lockdown. They've made people cry in the most unlikely situations because they might be just just suddenly thought about a family member and that made them feel sad. What do you think helps you to express your emotions? For me, writing a diary or a journal or using a bit of scrap paper, just writing down what you're feeling and then either talking about it or dancing it out helps. You see, I love dancing and I can really express my emotions into my dance. But there are other ways that you could do it. Like maybe FaceTiming your friends makes you feel really happy and that would maybe get over feeling a bit more sad. But it is okay to be sad. There's nothing wrong with it. Other things include maybe drawing a picture or doodling might make you feel better. Listening to a piece of music or playing a piece of music. Singing, doing anything really can help you overcome sadness but sometimes it's okay to just not want to overcome it sometimes it's okay to just sit and be sad well I think you're right I think sometimes we do just have to sit and be sad because maybe it also reminds us about the things that really matter thank you for sharing your ideas with us and being so honest about the things that have been tricky in lockdown as well as the things that you found helps.